Hey guys, Salty Sam here. Today we're going to be playing a little bit of something different. We're going to be playing Resident Evil Code Mad Men. If you remember, well you might not remember, it's been a very long time. Back in the old days, Resident Evil had a in-between phase. We had 3.5, which was a paranormal survival horror game where Leon was infected with a virus and supposedly he was supposed to die. This is a fan recreation of that game. It was never released officially. And I'm going to try to fix that. Get to full screen. There we go. That's a lot better. So, October's coming up, and I wanted to play this game. Thank you for joining me. This is our first spooky dookie. Ooh. Right off the bat. Those controls are really, really weird. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. You can walk and shoot. Oh, cool. Look at that model, though. So this is the old model for Leon, or it might be a recreation, I'm not sure, but it looks just like it did in the in the trailer. How do I investigate? Investigate candle! Oh, I can run. Okay. That's gonna be useful when the zombies come. I think I saw something glowing over here. I can control my actual, like, flashlight, too. How do you investigate? This seems to be an unchanged recycled asset from a previous game. Okay. That's the door from the fourth game. This is just like the, the Spencer Mansion from the first one. And Leon actually runs like an actual person. Except he's running into walls. Mario! I mean... Uh, oh. Oh dear. Uh, Hello? Uh, the doctor is in. I'm here to give you your medication. You ordered some lead aspirin? I hear... Oh my. Hello? Have some pills. I don't know how to shoot. There we go. There we go. Take your medicine. But what is my ammo count? I'm victim to the T virus. No wounds. Better write this in my diary. Okay. Dear Diary, people are attempting to eat my yummy giblets again. I really wish they'd stop. The desk appears to have been damaged long ago. What happened in this place? Well, there's a zombie, so that's probably a good... A good clue. As good clue as anything. A lot of bad happened. Broken mirror. I'm sure there's some symbolic joke I could pull here. It makes you wonder though, did the zombies like, you know... Try to reload. Oh crap, that's not the reload. Maybe they he knew he had turned into a zombie. Huh, I'm beginning to doubt this place. I wonder why. Urgh, urgh. Sometimes the controls get stuck. Okay. Hey, I did a quick turn. I wonder if that zombie, you know, like maybe had some uh, memories of his previous life and realized that he should not have been a zombie. I don't like it when my shadows follow me. Hello? 
Is anybody out there? I don't like it when shadows write me love notes. Okay, that's cool. Now what was so important that you had to get me to come down here? Come back upstairs. Yours truly. It is... It is a love note. In the The hue turned all blue. Sounds really wintry outside. Can I go outside? There's no reason to go back out there. Is there a secret where you open it, knock on it three times and the dog eats your face? Guess not. Okay. It's really weird on how the layout of this is just like the Spencer Mansion. The door is being held from the inside. What oh, we got up here? I'm upstairs, love ghost. My body is ready for your possession. The door is locked. It needs a key. It needs the key in the shape of a penguin. The penguin key. Door is locked on the inside. Okay, at least they're well prepared for burglars. I can't fault them for that. Do I have a menu screen? Like, that's cool. Okay. Hmm. How much ammo do I have? Do I have even an ammo? Do I have a knife? I'm so confused. Hello? Well, you weren't fixed before. Hello? Still as handsome as ever. Could have sworn this mirror was more damaged. You're right, Leon. We got paranormal investigations going on. Oh, there we go. Can't shoot it. Okay, okay. Did he say anything else about the zombie? Did the zombie contain a key? I guess nothing is to be talked about against the zombie. Okie dokie. We're in the dark corridors. Oh my. Neon! My cousin from California. What are you doing here? Hello, Neon. I'm here to help you. What the hell is this? Nope. Shooting it doesn't work, and that's my usually go-to. I'm completely out of ideas now. Okay. Oh. Oh, crap. I do have a knife. Okay. I can walk in. I, can't, I keep forgetting I can do that. You can't do that in most Resident Evils. The atmosphere in this is awesome, though. Oh, man. I want to play through 3.4. Like, 3.5, like, for reals, though. This is a cool fan recreation, though. Hello, Neon? Neon, you idiot. You broke it. Neon! Is there any spooky dookies going on out here? Oh man. We were in the. In oh, the door's open down there. We were in the in between. It's like that one show Stranger Pings or whatever. Oh, whoa. Is that a suit of armor or is that a booty? Are you a booty or are you a 
suit of armor. So this is what was holding the door. He just gave in. So, like, is he burnt or something? Hello? Any zombies? Hello? Just your friendly neighborhood, Leon. I can't remember Moonlight Sonata. That's an Easter egg. But he didn't do Moonlight Sonata. That was, um, Rebecca and Chris in the first one. That was supposed to be where you got the shield for uh, Yawn's battle. I'm remembering the olden days. The gooden days. Candles. Shame I don't have any tinder boxes. Open. Oh, hey, it's opening. First time a door actually obeyed us. Is it loaded? That's kind of weird that it starts you off facing the door you just came through. This looks like a scene just straight from Resident Evil 4. It's all castle-y too. It's definitely a different... Hey, this is the picture from the, uh, the first game. I don't think that one was, though. That one's been censored. YouTube censorship. Alright. Okay, let's find some zombies, because I want to shoot something now. Yeah, this room is definitely from Resident Evil 4. I remember this one. Cool how he opens the door. Hmm. Here's another dang mirror. He spelled trouble for me last time. This mirror seems normal at least, but it had a clink clink sound, which means it requires an item. And the doors stay open in this one. Interesting. Hello? Special Agent Leon here to shoot you in the face. Does anybody need any shooting in the face? Well, that's foreboding. Oh yeah, that's my jam. Oh, swivel, swivel, swivel. That was my, that was my jam. Oh. Well, at least the zombies have good taste in music, at least. I need the key in the shape of a panda. Just checking out the architecture. It's interesting how when it gets to this kind of screen, I can only control the camera. But when I back up and I go to this screen, the camera control is the flashlight. And that's actually genius. I'm surprised no other games really do that. I like that. That needs to become a thing for most survival horror games. I'm pretty sure this door was... Oh, wait. That's the door I came through. What about this door? Where's this go? It's locked from the inside. Okay. Sometimes the controls are a little unresponsive, but outside of that, I'm, this is interesting. This is very interesting. Door is locked. Okay. 
So everything's freaking locked down. Oh, goodness. Oh, dude, remember that? Like, it's a theory that when the camera does that, Umbrella is watching you from a camera. I want to check something. I doubt there'd be a camera up there. I want to check. Is there a camera? Camera would have been like right here. No, I don't think there's a camera. Oh well. I remember this from the, the original trailer. Oh cool, we can see outside. Well, I thought this was like top floor or something, but apparently we can just jump right outside into the courtyard. Oh willy nilly. Gonna wipe my feet. Don't want any bring in any snow. What's this? Ew. I don't want it. Take it back. And I'm back into the I'm back into the demon side of things. The demon world. Is there anything over here? There's nothing. Okay. Any other demons? Like it looks like I could go upstairs maybe. I'm checking to make sure there's no monsters. Oh, the pictures are all blank now. Well, that's a little different. There's something going on with the radio. Need to adjust the antenna. It's not turning off. Something's gonna chase me. Something's gonna chase me. Something's gonna chase me. Something's gonna chase me. I know it. No, guess not. Okay. The dining room. Hopefully I'm not on the menu. Hello? Is this the exit? That's kind of weird that they'd have all these weird fancy medieval architecture but they'd at least have an exit sign. I guess it's not really an exit sign. But it's definitely pointing me here. Stupid exit sign. You, mis you misled me. There's Salazar symbol, I think. Okay. Oh, I bet you have to go back to the mirror. I bet you there's something going on with the mirror now. At least I, in this demon world, I can keep my pistol. Hi ah. Neon, what's going on? I don't know, Leon, I'm scared. Well, man up, Neon. Man up. You're the one who has to continue Chris Redfield's her heritage or whatever. I hear songs. It's Moonlight Sonata. Someone's playing the Pinanos. Where's the potatoes at? I thought the banana was here. That one was originally like ripped off though. <gasps> there was something on the table. It's the leg of the baby or whatever. Come on, pick it up. Arm. 
arm of a baby. You have the arm of a baby. Okay. Somebody doesn't like that I touched their baby's dis arm for some reason. I think your baby has more things to worry about. I mirror pain and death. Hi, mirror pain and death. I'm Leon. Neon, you don't have to write to me. Oh my god. That's freaky. Okay. Neon. There's something behind you. The true mirror is reflected. coming from here but I can't get here it won't open ah, okay. um creepy lady could you let me go you want to go knife to knife Got some very long legs, lady. Okay. There's an invisible wall here. supposed to do that <laughs> okay well first attempt didn't go too well apparently I don't know what I was supposed to do there well let's try it again we'll breeze through it this time I saw someone Lights just playing tricks on my eyeballs. Ah! Hello? Ah! 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 Do you need assistance? Just in case. Victim to the T virus. No wounds. Better, better write this in my diary. You could be more masculine and be just say, it's my journal. I'm writing a journal. The Spencers were well educated. So this is a Spencer mansion of some sort. 
I mean, he did have like one in Europe, so is this the Europe one? Broken mirror. I'm sure there's some symbolic joke. Yep. And then spooky shadow demon. Ah! He writes his love letters. I mirror pain and death, or I mirror life and death. What was I supposed to do? Kiss it? Come back upstairs. Son of a bitch. Okay. I mean, so far, I think that one zombie is the only enemy we've come across. Ew, dusty. Talk about the corpse. You don't want to say nothing. Okay. Chris warned this mirror was more damage. There's nothing in the mirror that's supposed to be freaking me out, is there? How'd I see? Oh! What the heck is this? Oh man, I'm so handsome. Mm -hmm. Oh wait, hey look. Clippings! Do we see secrets? Secrets. Oh, okay. And then come here and then... Weird scream, then bushed mirrors. Seven years bad luck. Okay. Touch the bar. You just gave in. Oh, this is where the piano was playing, but we couldn't get back to it. Because the door was locked. I guess the guy was blocking it, I guess? This isn't the end of the demo, is it? Like when you shoot the, shoot the guy? This room's pretty well lit. We don't need a flashlight. We'll see it conserve our batteries. I picked up an item. I picked up the arm. So technically, you gotta use the arm somewhere. This looks like it should be. Is there no arm on this right now? Negative. The mirror seems normal at least, yeah, until. Until it's not. Until you shoot it and then you blow your own brains out and then a chair just like magically appears over your corpse. I'm gonna check this place before we do the whole freaking demon thing. What does this do? Door is locked from the inside. So there's nothing here in the good world where anything can happen. Okay. Let's go in here. Listen to my favorite tune. Can I just leave the music on? The 
demon baby. He ain't here. Where are you, demon baby? Guess I gotta turn off the music. It's requirement. It's a requirement. Don't give me copyrighted. Leon piss. Leon wants his money. Wait. Is that... Is that one guy? Ha. Huh. The Mad Prince guy. I can't remember what his name was. you put a lamp for me. Thank you for pointing me to the right direction. Like, is there a way to combine items? Because we pick up the doll here, and then we get the arm. Am I stuck? You didn't do the thing. There you go. There's nothing there right now. Mirror's normal. I start hearing Moonlight Sonata. Creepy. Be creepier if this was Chris. Um, lamps are pointing me to items, so maybe I can use that for something. Pick up the missing arm. The missing arm. This looks like it should be movable. True mirror is reflected. True mirror is reflected. I shot at it in the real world and died. So shooting at it in the fake world from like here should do the trick. Shooting at me? Sorry, Neon. True mirror is reflected.
Hmm. I want to look at this. Let's do one here. Let's look at that door. I don't want to fit the frame. Ah, oh, what is in that house? your arm back or not <laughs> suicide That's different. I'm gonna have to look up a strategy guide. I'm so awful. All right, guys, I'm back. I didn't look up a strategy guide. You did. You looked up the strategy guide. All right, I looked up a stretch guy. I'm sorry. So what we're gonna do is we were kind of close on the right path, but we didn't quite get it right. I'll show you what we're gonna do. Uh, when we come up to the creature, we got a knifing. Okay, I'm going. to practice on this guy. I gotta knife you. Hello. Hi, Eugene. Don't come any closer, Eugene. Get away from me, Eugene. Now don't touch me, Eugene. Bye, Eugene. Good night. No books. Let's write this in my diary. In my man diary. My little black book of numbers like Claire and uh, Jill and Ada and Ashley. But I didn't meet Ashley on this one, so. Broken mirror. So I don't even know if Ada's alive. I still got her number, though. Spooky ghost. Spooky ghost wants to play. Do you want to play? I do go spooky ghost. I do. Come on, pick up. Pick up the... There you go. Come back upstairs. Yours truly. Oh my. I get caught in this corner every freaking time. Yeah, I looked up a strategy guide for a demo. Yeah, I know. I know. Hey, the mirror. It's not damaged now, Bob. They must be using Gorilla Glue. Neon, it's crazy. Crazy what Gorilla Glue can get you. Oh. Um. 
Alrighty. Oh my gosh, the double doors. Are you leading me into your bedroom? I don't know the Moonlight Sonata. Wish you could play it though. weird how the so you press the left one button to pull your gun out and right one to fire it's the opposite with your knife you press the R1 to bring out your knife and L1 to, to slash save them batteries Turn off the copyright. I think this room was reused in another Resident Evil as well, wasn't it? One in four as well? I think it was. Turn off. Oh, you can't even turn it off. It ain't worth going over there. Alrighty. Get back into the groove of things. Let's find that missing arm. I'm stuck in a doorway. You didn't see that neon. I hear the moon lights in Ida. Oh, it's so creepy. It's reminiscent of the bad days because I didn't do those. That puzzle. It's the missing arm. Ah, bad stuff. Okay, what you do in this one, you won't believe it. I figured this out by watching a strategy guide. What you do is you take, go over to this guy. Okay, you see him in the mirror. Take out your knife and you cut yourself. That's how you progress. Ah, I cut my arm. I, I think you're bleeding. See blood on the ground? No. Oh, there is a little drop of some. Yeah, I can see it. Man, that's a lot of blood. I should do something about that, Leon. Ow. I got a burrow burrow. Uh -huh. Special Forces got a burrow burrow. Okay, okay. So. Now we can go through the exit. There we go. Oh, somebody fired. Oh, they, they didn't turn on the air conditioning. Oh my god. Oh, it's so nasty. It was being Friday too. Oh, it's in my mouth. So that was the demo of Resident Evil Code Madman. We didn't even get to see the Madman, but it was fun. It's a fun little demo. So if you guys are interested, I can't link it, 
because of copyright stuff. Probably shouldn't even be playing it. Oh well. If you want to, you can check out Shingu's works. That might lead you down the right path. Also, you could Google it and you'll probably find it, unless it's been taken down already. By the way, this has been Salty Sam's Spooky Dookie Adventures. Hope you enjoyed, and um, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.